reverie. I drifted in a dream. It seemed I walked with Raleigh and his scallop shell, or heard long-forgotten pleadings from Dowland's lute, or like a little dog who accompanies the enigmatic lady of a subtle unicorn tapestry, I kept a watchful eye on impossibly feathered birds, my nostrils flared, inhaling the exotic perfume of pomegranates and lilies. What world is this? The realm of poetry's fine mist, the entrance to the garden of the heart, which is open to those who have first endured the whims and taunts of the moon, and then been rewarded by her sympathies. How did I arrive within the walls of this labyrinth of roses? When long I believed that I was the courtier with keys, who, approaching the girdle of time, found the keys did not fit. Is it Grace who spilled a drop of precious wine upon my brow and caused my eyes to open wide to love's glory? Or am I simply some fortunate wanderer who pitied by providence is taken in as one would open the door of a warm home place to a sweet and gentle orphan child who begs with plaintive plea relief from the winter's wrath outside. People in Japan will be relying on nuclear-free power next month for the first time in more than a year. The operator of the last two reactors still online plans to halt them for regular inspections. Kansai Electric Power Company wants to shut one reactor at the Oi plant in Fukui Prefecture on September 15th. It's already applied to stop the other on September 2nd. Japan took all of its nuclear reactors offline for checks after the 2011 earthquake and tsunami. The Nuclear Regulation Authority allowed the OE reactors to restart after they passed new safety guidelines. Operators of five other nuclear plants have also applied to put their reactors back online. Cluster Fox. This is not a good message for our kids.
Hi everybody, thanks for watching my dumb video. Hope it didn't make